turn over here to uh, St. John. Turn over here to St. John. The, uh, the, uh, it's the uh, 15th chapter. <coughs> St. John, the 15th chapter. And the 13th verse. My text this morning is that there is no friend like Jesus. My subtext, if you want to get it, a, it talks about a well, true value of friendship. The true value of friendship. That is my subtext. Mm -hmm. But my text is that there is no friend like Jesus. If we turn over here to mm -hmm. turn over here to the uh, thirteenth, fifteenth uh, chapter, and the thirteenth verse, I start with the twelfth verse. This is my commandment that ye love one another, as I have loved you. Mm -hmm. Now. Uh, I want to start off, the reason I started off when it said that the first commandment, this is my commandment, that you, mm -hmm. you love one another. Mm -hmm. And if we understand what it, what it means that God would meant for when we were talking about loving one another, God, God wanted us to be in agreement with one another. We have to understand, I have to understand this, that loving one another, it doesn't mean that I love my love my own own race, uh, a race of people who I, I'm, you know, I'm involved with. I'm black, I'm white, I'm Hispanic, I'm Asian. But he said love one another regardless of creed or color. The Bible said that God is no respect of a person. That, 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 that God didn't, that God didn't, you know, didn't, didn't make a, 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 a difference between, a different with the Jews and the Gentiles. Mm -hmm. Because all we was included in, in, in the bunch. It said love love one another. If we are in the body of Christ and we 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 are saying that that we are Christians and that we are believers and we don't love one another, there's a problem. Because if we don't love one another, that that is going to keep us out of heaven. Number one thing that is going to keep us out of heaven is love. Amen. Amen. Huh? Amen. That we have to love one and one another. Amen. You know, Amen. that was very important that Jesus was saying that the disciple was asking, who is going to be great among us? You uh -huh. know, who is uh -huh. going to be first? And, and who is going to be the chief? Yes. And, and, and all this yes. other stuff. And who's going to sit on your right hand, my Lord? He said, that is not for me to give. It. Uh -huh. huh? That's right. It was not. It was not for me. It was not for me to give him. Other words, that Jesus said, "Don't be focused on. Don't be focused that 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 who is going to who is going to be first. Amen. But 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 Jesus prayed. He prayed and said. He prayed and said, "Father, let them be as one as we are one. Yes. Amen. You Amen. know, God want us to be one. Amen. God yes, want us know. to be one. God want us to be one in family. God want us to be one in husband and wife." God wants us to be one. Amen. When a person is on a team, a football team, uh, you know, see, because they can't win games being divided. Amen. They they have to they have to be they have to be on one accord. They have to be in an agreement. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. See, because that is part of being uh, being a friend. A friend that you you are on good terms. That's Just right. like in order to be in, in a football on a football team, you have to be on good terms. Mm -hmm. You have Amen. to be. You have to be in an agreement. Amen. You created a fellowship because you are on the same team, and you all work together as one. Even as on a basketball team, you all work together as one. Mm -hmm. If you're in the military, the military can't win war if it's all divided. If they if they're not in an agreement, That's if right. one is, if the lieutenant is saying going right and, and, and the general is saying going left, they are they are divided. It is very important. It is very important to be as one, walking, walking in an agreement. The reason that family is so divided that that they don't they don't love one another.
on the other. One party said, well, I'm loving only these are my kids over here. And then the other party said, well, I'm loving those because these are my kids over here. They never come together in an agreement because they, they don't love family as in a whole. They don't love the children as a whole. When husband and wife don't come in agreement, when the indifference and all this other stuff, they, they're not walking in, in true love. Amen. That's right. The people that say, well, that, you know, he said, my commandment that you love one another. And God wants us to love. That's right. You know, but see, see, because that if you're not walking, if you're not walking in love, if you're not walking in love, if, if, you, if you're showing hatred, if you're showing malice, if you're showing jealousy, you're not walking in love. Amen. If you're talking in corrupt communication, you're not walking in love. You, you know, you're not walking in love. Uh -huh. But but it said right here, it said no greater love than this. In the 13th verse, it said no greater love has no man than this, yes. that a man will lay down his life for his friend. Uh -huh. You know, oh wow, it is good good to yes. that Jesus called calls us. He calls us friends, but it said that no love has been demonstrated. No love has been demonstrated that he would I mean, laid lay, lay down his life for us. Uh -huh. We got to understand that, that Jesus loves, loved us so much that he was willing to give his life. Amen. Yes. Now, how many of us even today would say we have a friend that would give their life for us? Uh -huh. How many raise your hand and say you have a friend that, that, that would give their life for you? <laughs> Amen. And that's good to have those. That, that's good to have those kind of friends because Amen. you, uh -huh. you see, see, because that's true, true value, right? Mm -hmm. You know, see, because true value, you know, but the, the, the true price, the the genuineness of of the person, mm -hmm. true friends, true friendship. Mm -hmm. That you know that you know by having that friendship, you communicate with one another. You communicate with one another in, in, in that friendship. You, know, you, you, you talk about you talk about the different things that you are concerned about. But but in that friendship, you you're walking in an agreement. You love that person. There is nothing that you would do for that individual, and that's and that, and that's not very. There's not nothing that that person wouldn't do for you. Mm -hmm. Amen. Uh -huh. But I'm, I'm talking yeah. about that. Yeah. No greater love. We got to understand that Jesus came down to 42 generations. Jesus came down from heaven. He came down from heaven and was willing to die. He was, he was abused. He was whipped. You know, from court to court, he was, I mean, the beards, beards would pull out. He was pierced in the side. He was beat up. He went through a lot of things that, that we could have eternal life. Mm -hmm. And sometimes we, and a lot of sometimes, sometimes, a lot of times we forget that the price that was paid for us to have eternal life. Now, I, I'm saying, I'm saying to you, if God is drawing you, if God is being patient with you, mm -hmm. if you have an opportunity to come into the house of God and to accept the Lord as your personal Savior, I suggest you get it right. Mm -hmm. See, because God is not going to continue to let us continue to hear his word. God is not going to continue to give the invitation and you continue to reject the invitation. Because there is going to come a point that God is no longer going to give you an invitation. Mm -hmm. and, and we got to really think of, we got to really think about that. And it's just like in a natural sense, if a, if, if a man is just always in, he's invite you over to he invites you to their functions, and, and he continues to invite you for months and months and for years and years, and all of a sudden, he gets to the point he just stopped because, because he gets to the point he said, well, okay, they don't want to come. You know, they don't want a fellowship. Mm -hmm. They don't want the friendship. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it's, he gets to the point that when he yeah. just stopped, he just stopped yeah. calling. That's right. Uh -huh. you know, he just stopped giving invitations. Uh -huh. God is that same way that if God continues to compel you, to compel you, to talk to you, to, to come and come and come, if he continues to reject it, he's not going to give you an invitation. Mm -hmm. Amen? Amen. Amen. And, 
And you said right here, and you said that that greater love has no man than this, that a man will lay down his life for his friend. Uh -huh. Ye are my friend, mm -hmm. if ye do whatsoever I command you. Praise him. Now, okay, there is a condition there. Ye, what? Ye what? Are my friend. Ye are my friend. If you do whatsoever I command you. Amen. Amen. Now, if you're not doing what he's commanded you, you're not his friend. Praise so Praise you're not a Christian. You're not a, you, 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 you're not a Christian. Mm -hmm. If you're not doing what he commands, uh -huh. what is God commandment? God wants us to live right. Amen. Huh? Mm -hmm. huh? Amen. God wants us not to put no other God before him. That's the word. Yes, sir. God wants us to keep yes. his commandments. Mm -hmm. God wants us to keep his statutes. Yes. God wants us to live holy and live righteous. If you're not in that category, you're not his. You're not his friend. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's you know, you know, it's, it's, you know, and your people need to stop fooling themselves. Uh -huh. You are not his Glory friend. God. You know, you know, and, 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 and people need to stop saying that. Say, well, well, I, I, I'm Jesus' friend. I'm a Christian. If you say that I'm a, a Christian and you lie, you homemongering and you fornicate and you talking corruptible talking, you hatred and you big, you have bigotry in, in your heart. You're not, you're not his. Amen. You, you're not his friend. Uh -huh. You know, see, see, because that, see, because it's just like it's just like a person who say, well, okay, this suit will be blue. This suit is this suit is, with, is blue. This is a blue suit. This is a blue suit. No, I don't have the black. This is blue. This is blue. No, this suit is not blue. It's black. And 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 what I meant by that is that you can say that you're a Christian so long, you begin to say you believe it. <laughs> you're walking in your sin. You're walking in unrighteousness. You're going to the strip thing. Uh -huh. you, 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 you're in that porno. Uh -huh. you, you're in all this other stuff. You, you're in the homosexuality. You're in lesbianism and all the other stuff. You begin to believe that. Well, say, I'm a Christian. I'm a, I'm a believer. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Amen. Instead of realizing what position you're in, instead of what the Lord delivered me out of the act. God hates sin. God hates yes. the act That's right. of, of sin. Yes, mm -hmm. Amen. Uh, God loves the person, but yes. God hates the act of, of sin. Amen. You know That's one it. of the things. Lord, you know God. one of the things that God hates yes. hates the most. God hates somebody that would lie to him, and God hates a pride look. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's right. Herod was saying that he was a great king that, you know, that was giving Herod the glory. You know, he was a glory. He looked good and all this other stuff. Giving the glory to Herod. All of a sudden, an angel came down to touch him. And the worms ate him up. Amen. Because of a pride look. God hate pride. Amen. God would deal with, God would deal. See, we have to understand this. That God will deal with us. Don't think that if you're walking in sin, that if you're walking in sin, that you you think that, well, everything that is happening with me is the devil. No, everything that's happening to you is not the devil. That's right. You know, but see, because there are things that you sow. You sow what you you sow what you reap. Mm -hmm. You see, because you you walk you walk in it, you walk in this sin. It said that it said that the that the trouble would come upon for on the wicked and like a it's like it's like a like a a uh, a uh, a uh, uh, large sum of water, it, you know, it's it's like a tower of water that that rushes in, that overtakes. Oh, glory to God! Mm. And it said right here, it said that henceforth I call you not servant, but the servants knoweth not what his Lord doeth. Uh -huh. Now, he That's said, right. okay, amen, amen, that's it, amen, yes. I didn't call you servant. Uh -huh. <laughs> I didn't call you servant. Mm -hmm. See, because, because <laughs> we serve him. We do serve him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we bow down. We kneel before God. 
I didn't call you servant. I didn't call you a queen. I didn't call you an, an associate. You know, so, you know, but because a servant knows not what you know, what his Lord do it. But you got to understand that close relationship that, that Jesus is saying here, what my father would tell me that I would make it known unto you. Amen. Every day that we pick up God's word, every day that we pick up God's word, God is revealing. God is revealing his father to us. The Holy Spirit is revealing God to us. Because every day that we pick up, every day that we pick up his word. Uh, see, it's a wonderful thing to, to, you know, to pick up his word and, and God begins to talk to you, begin to speak to you, begin to share ideas, begin to share creativities with you. It is so wonderful to have that kind, that, that, that relationship. You know, because I serve him because I love him. You know, I love God with all my heart, with all my soul, and with everything and with everything that is within me. Because because of that I, I'm so grateful, you know, that 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 he that Jesus gave his life for me. And he said, For henceforth I call you not servant, for the service knoweth not what his Lord doeth. But I have called you friends. For all things that I have heard of my father, I make it known unto you. You know, I call you, I call you friend. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I, I'm not, not going to hold secrets from you. See, because when That's you have right. that intimacy relationship Amen. that, yes, you know, see, because I share things with, with my wife and things to come. Or things with, see, because you, you, you don't hold secrets and stuff back from your friend. You share that with your friend. You you can you know you share that in confidence. You ain't got to worry about your friend yeah. sharing it with someone else. Amen. That's see, right. because because that see because that is a close connection uh -huh. that that friends that friendship that you have with with, have yes. with, with God. Uh -huh. I mean I mean it's a wonder it's a wonderful to to have that that relationship with God. Amen. Yes, Amen. See, 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 Amen. even God would let you know what the enemy, those hidden traps and those hidden things that the uh -huh. that the enemy is trying to to present. Yes. You know, because he would he would let he would let them know. Amen. Yes. And it said right here, it said, Okay, now ye have not chosen me, but I have chosen you. Now, we got to understand this, that Jesus said that you have not chosen Amen. me, uh -huh. but I have chosen you. Praise I was there from the beginning when we said, let us make men in our image. Mm -hmm. He was there from the beginning. In the beginning was the word, and the word was God, and the word was with God. And Jesus is that word that that even before Jesus died on the cross, he knew exactly what he was dying for. Amen. He knew exactly who he was, who he was, was dying for. And, but, you know, when he said that for God so loved the word that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believed in him should not perish, he should not Amen. perish. But have everlasting, everlasting life it means that that he should not, because he was presented with an opportunity. Amen. Everybody is presented with an opportunity. The whether well, they would accept it or not is up to the individual. They can say that they can say when they get before the throne of God that they wasn't given an invitation. They can say, well, 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 Lord, I didn't have an opportunity. No, they can they, they they can't say that. Amen. Be, see, because that every time that every time that when God give you an opportunity, like in even today in church, God have already recorded it. It Amen. already the angel and already wrote it down. Mm -hmm. Even Amen. already wrote it down. Yes. This has already been yes. video. 
You, you got your iPhone, you got your phone. You, you, your, your life is being videoed every day. Amen. Even the hidden things are being videoed every day. That's right. See, because you're going to give an account everything that you do. Amen. And don't think that God doesn't know what you know what you do. Amen. You may be hiding from everybody else, but you're not hiding it from God. Amen. Mm -hmm. He's hiding it from God. God sees everything. Amen. Mm -hmm. God see what you do. Now, everything is being everything is being re recorded because you're not going to have an excuse. Because He said in the Word of God, He said, "I have seen the dead, small and great. Uh, I see them young and I see them old mm -hmm. stand before God, and the That's books was right. open. Yes, you got to understand the books was open. If you, if your name is not written in the book of life, you you are going to an eternal hell." You're going to be judged and you're going to be cast into the lake of fire. Amen. It's not mama. It's not daddy. It's going to be standing there be, before God. It's you by yourself, by the heavenly host. God is going to call your name. God is calling your name. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's right. And who said that God is not calling That's your right. name today? There's mm -hmm. many people that say where they got up this morning, yes. they died today. That's right. See, you never know when Amen. you're going to die. That's right. See, see, because that's the chance that you take. Uh huh. You're taking a, ch you're taking, you're taking a chance. I know. Yeah. Oh, um, uh, you take it. You gamble it. You gamble with your soul. Yes. Amen. You don't know when you, you don't know when you're gonna die. You don't know if you're gonna be in a car wreck tomorrow. Huh? You don't know if that a straight bullet gonna not gonna come by and shoot you. You're not, you're not gonna know that. You can be at home and you die. Many young people just have a heart attack and they die. Amen. And they sleep. That's right. Because you go to sleep, that doesn't mean you're going to wake up. Amen. That's why it's good to pray at night. Amen. You don't know if you're going to wake up. Well, okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Well, I'm going to just go to sleep. You don't know if you're going to, you know if you're going to wake up. You just, That's just right. you know, a person just gambling. Uh huh. They gamble with their gamble with their their, their soul. They just play like right. a Russian and roulette. Uh -huh. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna play with this. Uh -huh. But he said, "Ye have not chosen me." See, because see, we got to understand the chosen part that that was not on our terms. Amen. <laughs> it was Amen. not on our terms. Thank you. you know, it it, 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 it was Thank on his you. term. It said that Lord you didn't God. have Thank a term you. in this. Thank you, Lord. Huh? Thank this you. is on my term. I was there Thank from you. the beginning. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> I am the beginning, and I am the end that Jesus yes. said that yes. I am. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. See, because Amen. that I chose you. Yes. Yes. It wasn't up to you. It was up to you to choose me. Amen. I have chosen you. Mm -hmm. Huh? Oh Amen. my God. Oh Amen. my God. See, I said, Oh my God. See, I, I'm, I'm glad that I'm glad that that, that, that Jesus had mercy on on, on, on me. Mm -hmm. I'm glad that he had mercy on you. He could, oh my God, he could have saved somebody else. He could have, he could have let us continue to walk in sin and, 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 and oh you know, God. and, and die. And, and we died in our sins and we have eternal life in hell. And we ought to just praise and thank God for the opportunity that we have yes. to praise Amen. him and to glorify his name. Amen. Because he is Amen. worthy. Amen. He yes. is worthy. Glory he is God. worthy thank to you. To yes. be praised. Hallelujah, Lord. Oh, he is thank worthy you. to be praised. Oh, glory, glory to God. God. Yes. If we think glory about the price that Jesus yes. paid Hallelujah, on Calvary, if we yes. think about the misery, the hurt, and the yes, sorrow Lord. that the heavenly Father yes, went through when his son died, it said yes, that the son yes. refuses to shine. Yes, it means yes. that the father was. It means that the father, yes. God, was hurting when Lord his son God. died on the Lord died Lord on the God. cross. His, yes. He was hurting yes. when his son Lord began Lord to be abused, yes. abused and neglected when his son Lord was beaten, yes. when his son was beat to a pulp. Yes. When blood came streaming down, when it said, when it said, Father, move this cup from me, and God had to turn his turn his back. But Jesus said, nevertheless, Father, let your will be done. Amen. Mm -hmm. Yes. Amen. Yes, and there was people that walked with Jesus. Lord, that walked with Jesus. Yes. That walked with him. But when they came for him, they ran and hid. Amen. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. They denied him. Uh-huh. But when he, thank you, Lord Jesus. oh my God, but the third day when he got up, 
that same one that cut off the man's ear, that same one that denied him and said, I'm not one of them. And he said that he was going to be denied three, told Peter that he was going to deny him three times. But, but oh my God, when he rose and risen from the dead, oh, but his mercy and his grace. And yes. he said, where's Peter? Yes. Oh my God. Glory to God. Oh my God. Oh my God. But look at the mercy. But look at yes. look at That's look at the Amen. grace. Amen. Look at the Amen. love Amen. that God Amen. shows us every Amen. day. Yes. And not Amen. only that, that Jesus died Amen. in the prison, but he sat on the Amen. right hand of the Father. Yes. But 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 God Glory loved us God. so much Hallelujah. that He did not leave us comfortable. Hallelujah. That He sent back as yes. a comfort for us to give us strength in yes. the times of sorrow yes. and and trouble, Amen. and he sent us back the Holy Spirit. Amen. He sent yes. us back that comfort of God, yes. that teacher. Amen. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Amen. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Amen. Oh my God. Amen. Yes. Oh my God. Amen. Yes. See, see, because when I think about the love of God, when I think about the love of God, that, that when he said, I would never leave you, that I would never forsake you, I know that he would never leave. Your friends would leave you. Lord Your family Lord. will leave you. Lord. But God would not leave you. Amen. That God, Amen. God is God. Oh, my God. God is true to his word. That he would never believe you. When all the money is gone. God will be there. When you're hungry, God is there. When you're sick, God is there. God is there. When you can't be in your sick way, God, God is there. When, 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 when you need to, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Amen. Oh my God. Hallelujah. When you don't have a place to stay, God, God is there. Amen. When you don't have no money, Amen. God is, God is Amen. there. Amen. God Amen. is there. Everybody Amen. else will leave you that yes. God would be there. God would be there for you. Amen. Mm -hmm. Glory to God. Oh my Glory God. to God. Thank you. God would be, God would be there for Amen. you. Amen. Yes. You got to understand the goodness of the friendship. See, that's a friend that would never hey, be. Hey, hey. God, yes. Amen. See, that's a friend hey, that, can do, that can do for you in times of trouble. Yes, the Lord. Hey, hey, hey. That's a friend Ooh, that his finances Lord. and his resources hey, hey. are limited. Oh, my God. That is a hey, friend hey. that you can ask hey. in the name of Jesus. Hey. Oh, oh, my God. That, 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 you can speak to the, to the wind in Jesus' name and the wind stops. You yes. can speak to that mountain yes. and that mountain yes. be removed Hallelujah. in Jesus' name. Amen. You can lay yes. hands on the sick and the sick yes. will recover in yes. Jesus' Amen. name. Amen. Oh my God. Yes. You can speak hey. to the head on the blind and eyes Woo. and the blind and eyes will open in Jesus' name. Yes. Hey. Yes. What would it profit to have all of these millions 
Yeah. All is me, and it's, and it's God's will for us to be rich and not poor. Poor is poverty. Poor is sinful. But it's God's will for us to be rich. Mm, glory to God. But what would it profit if he gave the whole world be present as a king to us and lose his soul? Have you thought about being entertained and lose his soul? You can't come back. You know, you said we up there singing in heavenly choir. That's a lie. You ain't singing in a heavenly choir and you walking in sin. That's a lie. You Amen. went to hell. Whatever state that you was in when you died, that's it. If you was filthy, you was filthy when you died. That's if you right. was unrighteous, you yes. was unrighteous when you died. Yes. Huh? Yes. yes. Amen. If you yes. were shooting up with drugs and you died, you was in that same condition when you died. Yes, sir. It's nothing nobody can do after you done died and praying over you. You're yes. dead. That's right. Amen. Judgment has Amen. already been determined. Amen. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Let us stop putting people in heaven that went to hell and live a ragged life and get out, get out. And we have a funeral and we get up there and lie. We get up there and lie. And said, because this person went to church one time and they had a relationship with God and we celebrate, they going on to hell. They went to hell. That's right. Mm -hmm. You're going to hell for lying. The preacher's going to hell for lying too. That's you, right. You don't, 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 stop, stop, stop lying. Mm -hmm. and if we live in a regular life and we say that we are Christian, we're lying. That's a lie. That's he right. said that Amen. a life would not that's tarry right. in my sight. Amen. That is a lie. Amen. That's right. Yes, sir. If you're a saint, you're a hatred and bigotry and all this other stuff, you're going to hell too because you hate. You're not walking in the love of God. That's right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Say, you didn't chose me. Huh. You know, what? let's get out of this and say, you know, I chose God. <laughs> you know, I chose him. I no, you didn't chose me. I chose you. That's the word. Yes, sir. Praise him. Oh, Praise glory him. to God. Praise him. I chose you. Praise him. Uh huh. It said that every knee shall bow, every tongue shall confess that Jesus is Lord. Amen. Yes, Everybody sir. is going to bow down. Amen. Everybody Amen. here is going to bow down. Amen. Before Jesus. Amen. Everybody. Amen. Glory to God. That's the word. Yes, Whether you have any knees or not, you're going to bow. Amen. Be yes, sir. You're going to bow yes, before sir. God. Woo. Hallelujah. Bless the Lord. Amen. Bless the Lord. Bless because the Lord. we are not our own. Because, Lord. because Jesus said, our flesh belongs to me. That's right. Oh, mm -hmm. I created oh. all. Ain't no other God. There is nobody that is comparison to me. Amen. I am the beginning. He told Moses, Moses said, you know, Lord, what, what, what is your name? He said that I am. <laughs> he didn't say I am God, Jehovah. He said I am. Amen. That means the end. I am only. <laughs> there is I am. <laughs> I mean, there is nobody in comparison to me. I am. I'm in. <laughs> Oh, glory to God. Mm -hmm. Oh, glory to Bless God. Bless the Lord. Glory mm -hmm. to God. Glory to God. Okay. Yes, sir. Now, it said, ye have not chosen me, uh -huh. but I have chosen you, and ordained that you should go and bring forth fruit. Huh? Uh-huh. It's just up to us that God has, he has chosen us, and he has ordained us to go forth and bring forth fruit. It's, it's, it's us as believers. That we should bring forth fruit. That we should share the love of God. We should share our testimony to how good that how good God is. That a person don't have to be bound in sin. Mm -hmm. That that you can live a righteous life. That God has better things for you in life. Amen. Huh? Amen. Yeah. Oh my God. My God. You know. Oh, thank God. There is no friend like Jesus. There is no one that is, is comparison to his, his friendship. 
Now let's turn over here to, I want somebody to turn over here. Let's go to Matthews uh, 7 and 23. I think that's what. There's a point that I wanted to bring out. Matthews. Okay, let's start with the 21st verse. From Matthew 7, 21, 22, and 23. Not everyone that saith unto me, Lord, Lord, shall enter into the kingdom of heaven. <laughs> but he that doeth the will of my Father, okay. Okay. which is in heaven. Not, okay, it said not. Huh? Amen. It said not. Amen. How many people that call him Lord, Lord every day? You know what Lord means? Lord means that you're the master. That's He's right. the master. He's my Lord. Amen. <laughs> mm -hmm. yes, He's my covering. Uh -huh. Praise him. My Lord. Praise him. Everyone that call me Lord, Lord, what do people say today? What do people talk about when they get in trouble? I'm a Christian. Mm -hmm. I'm a believer. Huh? People, everybody, everybody, even the drunk say I'm a, I'm a I'm a Christian. Even the dope dealers say I'm a Christian. Even these people in Provoga, they've been saying, I'm a Christian. That's right. Everybody's saying I'm a, I'm a Christian, but hey, now how can I be in an agreement if I'm not walking in, if I'm not walking in fellowship and relationship with Jesus? Huh? Mm -hmm. uh, what do light have the light and darkness walk hand in hand? No. No. Praise him. Uh-uh. Mm -hmm. and, and, and what it said that? That said, Lord, Lord. Mm -hmm. And go for God. Um, many, many. many will say to me, in that day, Lord, Lord, have we not prophesied in thy name? And in thy name have cast out devils and in thy name done many wonderful works. Okay. Okay. Well, they say, you know, I can say that I have done this, but it doesn't mean that I, that I have done it. When you got to look at your attitude within the work, let's, let's deal with the work. We said that we have prophesied in God's name, and what else? We have prophesied in thy name, and in thy name have cast out devils. Okay. We have prophesied in the name. We have, in other words, that we have taught, we have preached, <laughs> we have shared, we have listened, but it wasn't in our heart. Mm -hmm. it wasn't, we didn't have a relationship. It wasn't in our heart. We were just talking. Right. You know, we just, you know, pick up the Bible and read the scripture, uh -huh. and, and it wasn't in our heart. See, but see because you, we got to understand this. This is not connected to relationship. You was not, see, you read the word, but you was not connected to it. Huh? You was not connected to it. You read it. Right. You didn't have the relationship. You didn't, you didn't have the relationship with the one <laughs> that it's the word. <laughs> you didn't have a relationship. You, I pro he prophesied your name. Lord, we cast out, we cast out devils in your name. Uh huh. Yes, sir. Said so we cast out devils. Uh huh. We appear to. <laughs> we appear to. We cast out devils. It doesn't mean that the devil came out, but we appear to. That you know, we cast out devils in your name. And what else did it say? And in thy name, the many wonderful works. Uh-huh. Now, we, uh, see, but did you, have, did you guys hear this when he kept, you hear this talking about his name? Talking about his name. Mm -hmm. You remember when we were in the, in, in, the, in the, I believe it's the 15th chapter of, you know, of St. John, when he's talking about, if ye do the will of my father, ye yeah, you are my friend if you do the will of my father. And then it said, then it said, I'm latter, then I'm you said, whatsoever you ask the father, and 
you know, in my name that what he would do. As mm -hmm. the Father in my name. Because of the relationship. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So they right here they talking about they talking about, well, we've done this in your name, in your name, in your name. But how can we do this in your name is that we you know that a lot of people do things for themselves. They preach, they get money and all the other stuff. They do it because fame and fortune for their own self. They build ministries for themselves. Want to get a name for themselves instead of lifting up the name of Jesus. I did this in your name. I did that in your name. In your name. In your name. But didn't have a relationship. And now go, go on down a little bit further. Amen. And then will I profess unto them, I never knew you. Okay, then will Jesus, what? Profess unto you. Profess unto you. Uh-huh. Unto them, I never knew you. Unto them, mm -hmm. I never knew you. I never knew you. I never. <laughs> me, never knew what? You never had a relationship with me. Amen. Huh? I've never given you the authority to use my name. Huh? I've never given you the authority to lay hands on the sick and the sick shall recover. I've never given you the authority to take up serpents. Huh? I've never given you the authority to cast out devils in my name. Glory! Because I never, I never have given you the attorney, the, the power of attorney. Mm-hmm. Oh my God, did you really listen to what I just said? What it just said it. See, because and because that we as believers, we really don't know the friendship and the relationship and the power that God has given us. If we really knew that the power that God has given us, all the power over the enemy. If we really knew that the relationship, the authority that God has given us to speak unto mountains and mountains be thou removed. And that we can ask the Father anything in his name mm -hmm. that he will give to us. Why that we are living in poverty? Why that we are letting the devil bully of us? Huh? Why that we are walking in walking in life? Why that we are not walking in victory? Why are we walking in sickness and, 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 and the diseases? And, and that's not God's will. We have to use the, the authority. To, we have to appreciate. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. I heard that. We have to appreciate that the relationship that we have with God. Mm -hmm. So when we neglect the relationship, we can receive full benefit of the relationship. That's because right. we are neglecting the relationship. Uh -huh. Oh, my God. Oh, thank you, Holy Spirit. Oh, thank you, Holy Spirit. We got to have, we got to, we got to have true value. We got to value the relationship. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Amen. The friendship. Amen. Yes, Amen. Amen. And we, see, and 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 the, and the average believer always think about that. They, they, they really don't value what Jesus did. Hmm. Jesus gave His life. Jesus gave His life. Mm -hmm. And some people just, you know, they just pass by like, like it was nothing. See, because when you walk in in sin, when you live in sin and doing everything for the devil and doing whatever thing the devil wants you to do, you tell God you don't appreciate the death and the, and, the, uh, and the birth of our risen Lord and Savior. Mm -hmm. Death, mm -hmm. burial, and the resurrection yes. of our Lord and Savior. Amen. You yes. don't appreciate it. Uh -huh. And you think God is going to let you get away? No. No, God's not going to let you get away. I have seen thousands of people that I ministered to that died without God, but now they're seeing my, they hear my voice and they're seeing my face because I share with them the word of God, what God said. Have you ever seen a person die before? Anybody seen a person die? Took their last breath. Have you seen a person fight to stay here? They die and they sin. They want everybody to pray for them. Have you seen a person die, get shot, their eyes was open, and they was trying to say something, but they was caught in that state. 
I have seen people that God has warned time and time and time again. But they died without God. They went into eternity. See, because when you go to eternity, that's it. That is, that's it. You know, I'd, I'd rather live, live a life that I could receive for, you know, the benefits of God, that the relationship with God. I don't want to live a whole life and a whole life that, yeah. that, that, that yeah. I don't spend eternity with Him. Yeah, amen, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm looking forward to of, of, of spending eternity with God. But I want, I want everybody else to go too. I want millions and millions and billions of people to go. Every time I get an opportunity to share with somebody the word of God, the love of God, that God loving, God loving kindness and tender mercy, that I want to share that with. Yes, Lord, you know? my God, my God. And I want to say this today. You, you, got, you got to think about where is my relationship with God, with Jesus, with the Holy Spirit? You got to ask yourself, do I have a, a true relationship with God? Do I have a friendship with God? Huh? Because if you don't have a friendship with God, your friend is Satan. That's your friend. That's your buddy. That's who you hang out with. That's true. You don't want to hear that, but that's the truth. If you don't have a relationship with God, that's right. Satan, is, Satan is your buzzer, book and buddy. That's your God. That's right. That's true. And that is true. That's when I was saying, you know, if you, you are my friend, if you do the will of. Oh my God. If you do the will of my father. Huh? You are my friend. If I was up, I would yeah. check my friendship. Uh -huh. I would check my relationship. Uh -huh. And see if my relationship with, with Jesus is true or false. Mm -hmm. huh? I would really examine myself today. And I'm saying, there, I'm saying to us as a whole, we need to examine ourselves. Yeah. Huh? Uh -huh. Yeah. You know. But the one thing about this is that, that the sad thing about this, don't get yourself in a state of being when you call upon God, that God will not answer you. Hmm. That's right. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Don't get yourself in a state like this. Yes. You know, the grasshopper thought they was flying high during the winter time and the spring time, you know, hopping, hopping eating, going from grass to grass and all this. He thought he was flying high, flying high. But the winter time came, you found him frozen on a fence. Mm -hmm. People right now, they think, well, I'm, I'm, I'm getting away. You know, you know. But, you yeah. know, but it's burden in my heart that when I see family, when I see friends, when I see members confessing that I love God and don't love him. Hmm. That's a great burden for a pastor. Knowing that you sitting in the congregation, you're going to hell. That's a great that's a, that's a great burden for a pastor. You know, the scene that he's pleading. He's telling you time and time again and people's plan. And neglect and don't want to get right. Have pride. Don't want to get right. And you die. That's sad. That's that's a burden. Yeah, that's a burden for the for you know for, for the pastor. You know, because you don't need because when it's over, when you die, he had to preach your funeral. That's it, it's sad because because you really don't know what to say. We, we, can, we can talk about those that are living. We can't talk about those that died in sin. We can't talk about those that become an everyday, that grew up in church and never had a relationship with God and died. Wow, that, that, that is a sad state. That is a sad state to be in. 
That is a dangerous state to be. And another dangerous state, I'm going to say this and quit. Another is a dangerous state that he that knows to do good and do it not. It's a sin. Mm -hmm. That's a dangerous thing. You would raise up in church. You know what's right. And you don't do it. Amen. That's right. That's a dangerous thing. You would raise up in church and you know what is right. And you don't do it. Oh, great, great punishment has come upon that individual. I have heard God in this time that I have prayed for people, that God has allowed me to pray for people during the revival and crusades and that. That the spirit of prayer doesn't come up to pray for that individual. It's that God said, no, no, don't, don't mention this person. Don't even bring this person even before me. It's a sad state when God gets angry, when God gets ups upset with, with you. There can't nobody do anything, can't nobody do anything about it. There can't nobody do anything for you. You know, that, that's a sad state. But on the other hand, God is a loving God. God is a merciful God. Amen. Yes, he is. God is a righteous Amen. God. God is a loving God. Yes, he is. Mm -hmm. God is long-suffering. Yes, sir. Yes. But when God, when God is tugging the day that you hear his voice, I hear that, hard not your heart. Mm -hmm. The day that you hear God's voice, you know that God is tugging at you to get it right. You don't hurt your heart. The day that you hear God's voice, harden not your heart. Amen. Because you don't know when your time is coming. You don't know mm -hmm. when you're going to die. That's right. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Amen. I'm going to take a chance. I'm not going to take a chance. I, I, you know, I'm not going to take a chance, you know, to allow myself to be caught up in iniquity and sin. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna allow anything to, you know, to cause to, to keep me out of heaven. Because that's eternal. Eternal. Hmm. You know, and my heart goes out for, for people all over the world. Goes out for, you know, people that are, that I know. It, it just goes out. You know, my heart is. You know, it's burden is that, you know, that when I can understand when to say that, you know, that it's talking about that narrow is the, the narrow is the way. You know, that in the last days that should be a great falling away. That people had a relationship with God. Then they said, Well, hey, I can't handle this. I can't endure it. I can't go through this. That's sad. You know, it's easy to be a quitter. Anybody can be a quitter. But it takes a special person to be able to do it. Amen. Huh? Mm -hmm. See, see, it's easy to live in sin. Because you don't have to do no what is right. You, 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 don't, you don't have no morals. You don't have no character. You don't have no integrity. Because your heart is evil. And it's corrupt. Because the only thing you want to do is whatever Satan tells you to do. Because you're just like a puppet on the string. Whatever which way to go, whatever you dance, he tell you which way to dance. That was Satan do, tell you which way to dance, tell you what to say, what to do. Go to that. The demon said, go to that. He just drawing you, drawing you, and drawing you, and drawing you away from God. See, he's gonna just see. He's gonna say a predator that draws you, continue to draw you away. If I, if you don't read, if you don't read the word, I don't care. If you don't read the word, he, 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 you know, don't listen to that preacher. Don't listen to that. I do what I want to do. He just drawing you. He just drawing you, you away. I don't have to go to church. I do what I want to do. He just drawing you. Just drawing you. Come. He just getting you further away further away, farther away from God. Then once he gets you out there, exactly where he wants you, 
He's going to destroy you. He's going to de 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 destroy you. Because he, 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 he got you from away from your saints. He got you away from your parents. He likes people to say, kids to say, when I get grown, I'm going to move away. Go ahead and move away. The devil is going to make a fool out of you. Because guess what? He hates you because your, your parents are righteous. He's going to make a mockery out of you. But the parents, as myself and as my wife and, and as we have children, we pray. We pray, God have mercy. I pray. I pray for all, I, all my kids. I just pray for them. God have mercy. I call their name. God, they don't know. Forgive them for their sin. You know, God have mercy. God, forgive them. God, they don't know what they're doing. God, I pray that. And when I continue to see them, see them going the wrong way, I say, oh God, I'm going to continue to intercede. And the devil tell you, say, you need to stop intercede. I got them. They are mine. So they no, Satan, they are not yours. You cannot have them. They, 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 belong to, they belong to God. I won't stop, stop praying. You might as well stop praying. They're not here on Sunday. They're in the street. They're, they're, they're committing all kinds of sin. They're fornicating. They're, they're, they're watching porno. They're doing all this ungodly stuff. No, but I'm going to continue to pray. I'm going to continue to confess. Yes, I'm going to continue yes, to confess That's right. that God, you know, your mercy and your grace and your love. I won't stop interceding. That's right. Amen. Amen. Because Amen. I will continue Amen. to pray. I continue to Amen. fast. I continue right. to be, you Amen. know, yes. you know, continue to do what I need to Amen. do as a, a pastor for God. You know, for the congregation that that they would have a real relationship with God, that yes. that, they, they, that they that they would know the meaning of true value, Praise Praise yeah. a relationship, Amen. Yeah. a friendship. Yeah. God bless. Amen. Amen. Amen.